Mic check. Mic check one two. Yo yo. What up, people? Just wait for some people to come in. See if the uh, the old notification squads alive. Just gonna post in Discord. Do be do 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 share stream copy link do 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 there you go boom yo Kenny Lessin Top Cat Ryan Time and Tide Mark Sam St uh, Stephen Michael Knowles Daniel Richard Jola, uh, EK, Xbox Play, uh, Ope Spoon, what we're fixing today, a few things mate, uh, starting off with a 1X, uh, Enzima, Jelena, Craig, Legend Rockplot, um, Sif, thank you, welcome to True Love, thank you for the membership mate, I appreciate it, thank you, thank you. Uh, Xbox One Power Pack has just started making a load of noises like a load ass fan. Mm. Thank you, dude. Appreciate that, mate. Um, yeah, it could be on the way out, mate. Might be time to th consider giving a replacement. Uh, could be a board issue, but most likely a, a power brick issue. Um, Matthew, welcome. Michael. Craig. Um, Rob Brown, Duncan, Dennis, Simon, uh, Mark, recent subscriber, come by, trying to fix, enjoying your stuff. Thank you, dude. I appreciate that, Simon. Thanks, mate. Uh, Win, welcome. Alexei, or oh, Alexei, uh, is this live? It is. Uh, welcome, Abagon. Uh, Charles, what's up? Got a PS5 for 180 euros. Nice. Paul, thank you, dude. Craig, became a member. Craig, thank you, mate. I really appreciate that, buddy. Uh, Lee, welcome, bud. Pops. Ugly cam, yeah. Cheers, Lee. Thanks, mate. Richard, Scoot, evening, my lover. Hope the movie's going okay. Not even started yet, mate. I'm still doing work on the house. Uh, but thank you. Appreciate it, mate. Starting with the 1X, mate. Look, it's a ginger. No, he's not a ginger. <laughs> Gordon, welcome, mate. I might take it apart see what he's loaded. Yeah, uh, well, I mean, if it's a power supply, just be careful. Just be really, really careful. White light of death repair. Uh, what console, mate? Wite, welcome. Your order went out earlier, mate. Dr. Cryogenic. Brandon. Uh, on. Uh, yeah, on out. Stretchable. Learn something new about repairs. I'm doing not all black resistors are resistors. Yeah, there could be caps. Or inductors. Um, Dylan, yo yo. Got some of your soul, I love it. Awesome win. Uh, yeah, actually, I think I remember posting yours. Yeah, awesome. New sub here, you're really good. Thank you. I appreciate that, uh, Voldania. Nige, long time, mate. Why are we on YouTube? Just random. Random stream. Your boys are so nice. How's it going, Camp? Graham, Ben. Um, Greetings from Australia. Welcome, mate. I'm definitely ginger. It's for you. Hey, from Australia. Hello. Did you just say ugly cam? <laughs> no, this is ugly cam. <laughs> yeah. Tab, welcome. Strawberry ginger. Strawberry blonde. And it's not strawberry blonde, it's hash blonde. Mm. Uh, the PS4 Slim, you're looking at... Uh, What's the price of a chip? Uh, you're looking at 65. Uh, PS4 original, you're looking at 90 because the chips cost like 45 pound each. Uh, they're not cheap. The chips are not cheap at all. Fixed an island TV yesterday, single tiny ceramic, ceramic cap was shorted. Oh, awesome, dude. Typical that is to kill the thing, though. 
good to see you live. Did you see a message in Discord? I haven't, mate, to be honest. Love the vids. Thank you, Philip. I appreciate that, mate. How's the house? Go in, get in there, mate. We do check your Discord DM later. Yeah, I'll try and uh, I'll try and check later, mate. Greeting from Manchester. Welcome. Uh, Ernst, I'm doing good, mate. How's the search going? Uh, we've got an house. I've just got work to do on it before we can move. Uh, it's Wednesday, not Monday. You're messing with my mind. Yeah. Yeah. No, just a random stream. I thought I'd do it on YouTube because I haven't been on YouTube for a fair few weeks. I have a PS4 Pro. Right. Right. Do, do, do. Yeah, you're welcome to book it in. Uh, oh, no. We love signs you want for your kids. Do you just want their names or put some cartoon characters on it? I'm not sure yet, mate. I'll speak to Sarah on that one. Perfect place for radio that only a mother could love. My mum didn't love it. She went and killed herself. <laughs> no, she didn't kill herself. I'm, I'm joking. She, she, she's not with us, but she didn't kill herself. Um, did you find a new gaff? Yeah. Yeah. When we... Uh, when we actually manage to move in. Kitchen's getting there slowly. Um, we'll get to it. We'll get it done. Is there nothing you can't fix? Yeah, apparently my hair most days. <laughs> uh, no, I've never messed around with UART, mate. But check out Steve B on YouTube. He does some stuff with UART. Kitchen looking good. Cheers, Pops. How's it going, Andy? What's your camera set up for your workbench? Uh, I use Sony ZV-1s, mate, with um, some cheap Amazon um, wall mounts. Uh, they are sturdy, but they're just cheap. What do we have to fix today? Uh, just the usual, mate. PS, uh, PS5s, Xbox One Xs. Please repair M1 MacBooks. I will when I get some more, mate, definitely. I actually shipped one out today. The, M1, the last M1 that I fixed has now been sold. Mark Bell, welcome. Um, Marcius, can you fix my laptop? Um, what's wrong with it, mate? Do you get many Series X coming with a broken disk drive? Uh, funny you should say that. The person that's right behind you, uh, right underneath you, get refurbed, um, has just picked a Series X up that came that literally got dumped on scrap for a very similar reason. Do we get house photos once it's done? I'll give a house tour. I'll, I'll do a house tour when it's done. A repair room tour. Yeah, when I do build a new workshop, yeah. Thanks, John. Cheers, mate. Yep, yeah, don't forget to like the stream. Like it now because you might realise that like, you don't like it later. When you're giving your flux in your shop. I've got to order some, to be honest. It's, um, it's on the to-do list, definitely. Let's get a repair done, but... Limited time only. Limited time only. On the merch shirts. Take the piece out of the Sony fanboys. <laughs> anyway, that's enough of my ugly cam. I saw that shirt earlier. Yeah. <laughs> No, the disk drive doesn't read a thing. Yeah, I, to be honest, I can't blame it for quitting <laughs> after putting them things in it. <laughs> Sorry, mate. Thinking about starting a stream, need some decent cameras for my bench and pick a, and pick and place machine and reflow oven. Nice, dude. Make sure you send me a link to that if you if you get that off the ground, mate. Definitely. Always looking for new content to watch. Cheers, Peter. Thanks, mate. Grandmaster C, welcome. Yeah, so Get Refurbed is Wayne. He's rebranded his channel. Um, check him out. He's going to be posting some new content soon. How's it going, Travis Stewart? Don't have anything to fix. <laughs> you can fix my teeth if you want. <laughs> All right. So... Anyway, let's get to some repairs because I'm not going to be streaming for long. A couple of hours, I think. I'm, I am absolutely knackered. I've been, um, I've been fitting kitchen cupboards all day. I've got blood blisters on my hands. I'm knackered. So let's get to a fix. Can you see my comments? I can, mate. Yeah, I can indeed. What you sorted out in the house? I'm working on the kitchen at the minute, mate. I'm building a kitchen. It was, it was literally a.
carcass when I started. Um, you know, it's not going to be top quality, but um, let's see if I can pull up a picture of what I've done so far. Um, it's not going to be top quality. I'm not really that good at DIY, but what screen am I on there? Yeah, that's the right one. It's a work in progress. It was a blank carcass when I started, so it is a work in progress. There's a lot to do. Um, gas work, water work, electrics. Well, I've done most of the electrics. Uh, the cupboards, well, this half of the cupboard is done. Um, I've got a toilet, I've got to put a splash back here. Um, I've got to box this off, well, blank this off. I think I'm going to get a sliding door for here and just use it for where the kitchen bin is and things like that, or something like that. Got to get the gas signed off, um, but there's a leak here on the uh, the gas. Um, yeah, I've got to grout the tiles. I've got to tile over the other side of the room. Uh, I've got to tile under here. I've got to tile on uh, tile the floor. Uh, this this junction here, this connection here on the gas main is leaking, so that's got to be fixed. Um, when we were fitting the bayonet for the cooker yesterday, I think we cracked the solder joint. Uh, but yeah, it's getting there. It's getting that roof. Yep, ceiling needs doing as well. Ceiling needs sorting out. It'll get there eventually. I'm not good at DIY. I have done this myself. Everything you see here I've done myself, apart from this plasterboard here. Um, everything else I've done myself, but it'll get there eventually. Lovely DMs in the background. My, my DMs are just, yeah, now people know what I don't actually reply. <laughs> I've literally got, how many messages have I actually got? 71. 71 messages. Shout out from, from New York City. Thank you, Matthew. Welcome, mate. My trade is IT and I'm doing DIY in my entire house. Yeah, it's a nightmare, mate. I've got a fucked Xbox One X if you want it. Um, it depends what you mean by want it. If you mean buy, I definitely haven't got the funds at the minute to buy anything. Um, all of my money is going into the house at the minute. Are you able to take on a job for an Azus ROG Strix? I am, but I don't know on time frames at the minute. Um, I am, to be honest, I haven't even had a chance to reply to emails for like a week and a half, two weeks. I've really been slacking because I've got to have, you know, I've got to prioritise. I mean, we've got to be out of this house in, on the 14th of March, so I've got to prioritise getting this new house up and running. Smoking's bad, okay. <laughs> I watch three. Ooh, no thanks. <laughs> Definitely wouldn't do that. Oh, yeah, I'm more than happy to take it for free, mate. And try and make a video on it at some point. To be honest, at the minute, most of the videos I'm making are just um, stuff with uh, stuff I've done on past live streams and stuff. How much did you pick up the house for? I've not bought it, mate. Um, part of the agreement of renting it is um, I haven't got to pay any deposits or anything like that and no rent up front and I get rent knocked off um, as long as I basically make it livable. So I've got six weeks from today to make it livable. I've been in there for a week and a half, on and off, doing that. You know, doing the kitchen and stuff. Um, and I'm already in for well over a thousand pounds on it. <coughs> I'm not moving far, no, but my new address is going to be private. I will be setting up a PO box for obvious reasons. Um, you know, the channel's too big now to really publish my address. So, yeah, I'll be setting up a PO box when I move. Right, let's have a look at this then. So, this is supposed to be a no power Xbox One X. Uh, I'm probably best to take the case off this because the case has been taken apart. Um, the note with this says that the customer has tried the power supply and didn't fix it. Yep, it's completely dead. Should be easy enough, hopefully. 
Maybe your gas pipes don't have the perfect amount of solder. <laughs> well, I think we cracked the pipe while we was, um, well, cracked the joint while we was um, installing the bayonet because we was twisting the pipe and stuff. So, yeah. Damn, you have some kind of contract. Uh, yes, yeah, we've got a contract, yeah. It's risky, but I'm doing what I've got to do to secure a house for the kids at the end of the day. Right, let's get this apart then. Make it nice and quick. So, no power. The power supply's been checked. Oh, sorry, the power supply's been changed and it didn't fix it. Probably going to be a retimer issue. I will see. Thought the gas cooker had to be soldered in. Yes. Um, well, yes and no. Um, from the gas cooker to the gas mains, no. Uh, that goes onto a bayonet fitting, um, which is like a, a self sealing push fit fitting. The bayonet fitting is soldered onto the pipe work though. But while we were soldering the bayonet fitting, um, we uh, we were moving the pipes. And then when, when it went to actually doing the gas safety check, because obviously it's got to be done properly, so I had a gas engineer doing it with me. Um, viewer of the channel and good friend. Um, and uh, shout out to Cyril. Came out yesterday, didn't have to come out, wasted two hours trying to fault find this gas leak. Um, yeah, I mean, he got paid for it, obviously, but he, he certainly spent a lot longer than he should have done. But yeah, we've just got to fix that minor gas leak and then the rest of it. The cook has been tested, so the cook is fine. Uh, just got to fix that minor gas leak and it'll pass the test. Banning gas stoves, Jesus. Thank you, Jova. Appreciate you. You can't beat gas stoves. I'll pick that range cooker up. It's a three thousand pound range cooker, and I picked it up for a hundred pound. Absolute bargain. Technic, how's it going, mate? Cheers, Mark. Thanks, mate. Appreciate that, mate. Right. So. My life's a bit easier because most of this has been taken apart. Let's just test the power supply, make sure we're getting 12 volts out. And we are. Yep, we get 12 volts. Cool. So, power supply is working. Yeah, the one X was very well designed. You can put you can put cartoon characters. I mean, I'll leave that to Sarah. Um, by the way, Sarah is referring to the same signs as the ones on my back wall. Um, I was going to put them on the kids' doors. Hundred pound cooking needs a V driver and a HDMI port. <laughs> <laughs> now, nah, on a serious note, the cooker was a bargain. I'm not going to grumble at that. Um, so my brother-in-law phoned me up. He was like, oh, I've got a range cooker. I said, oh, where's it come from? So I've just done a house clearance. The woman's having a new kitchen after two years. She spent two grand on this range cooker. And I looked it up, and they're currently selling for three grand. So it's, uh, it's an Isidia 11 kilowatt cooker. So, yeah, not. But, uh, yeah, I certainly weren't going to turn that down for £100. Winner, winner in my book. Right, well, I can't find absolutely anything, to be honest with you.
Doing read timers and HDMIs for a while, still trying to get bulb work, practice. Currently working on an Alva laptop that won't pair on. Nice. Um, yeah, I mean, the, the trick to it, mate, is just the, like, the more you do, the better you get. Um, you know, if you can if you can solder a V-driver, you can solder a, an IC, you know, you, you can pretty much do it at that point. Um, you just have to practice your fault-finding skills more than anything. And then you'll be good to go. But that comes with time, like, fault-finding skills comes with experience. And a PS4 that dropped off my fireplace mantle from the cat jumping. We'll play for two minutes and then shut off. Ooh. Hmm. Yeah, that could be quite a number of things to be fair to you, mate. Right, let's have a look under the scope at this then. Is everything going to work? Because I haven't been in the workshop for a week. Well, when was the last time I streamed on Twitch? I don't know. Um, last time I streamed on Twitch and that was the last time I came in here. Oh, why is it all out of focus? Wow, it's all slipping and everything. I need a new bearing. I need to sort out the bearings on this. Sorry, give me a second. I need to get the focus back on this and things. There we go. Right, so first area I'm going to go for is going to be the HDMI read driver. So I'm going to test C50 in resistance mode, see what kind of resistance read I get, reading I get, because that's the most common cause of no power on these. And we get 141 ohms. On C50, yep. So that is a bad reading. Supposed to expect anywhere from 3k to 10k in ohms mode, resistance mode. So the reason this stops working is because the um, <laughs> Brian, thank you, dude. <laughs> thank you, mate. I appreciate you. Um, yeah, so the reason this stops working is because it has got some 5 volt rails running through it. And when this goes bad, it shorts out the 5 volt rail, stops it turning on. So, chances are that's going to be the reason for this not working. Should be a nice straightforward repair. We haven't actually moved yet, mate. We're still waiting to work on the... Uh, I'm still doing some work on the house. There's still quite a lot to do. I need to do... I need to finish the kitchen off. I'm about 40% I'm about done. Um, and then once I've done the kitchen, I need to get carpets in and, uh, and decorate. We shall be moving from here around the 1st of March. And then hopefully I can start getting back to normal in terms of repairs, streams, all of that stuff. Come on. I hate these sometimes. Let me just increase my hot air.
These take quite the amount of heat to get off. That was at 480 degrees Celsius then. Uh, it was at 40% airflow and then I increased it to 60. I've got quite high because it's lead free solder and I'm not going to be putting it back on so. Plus the, um, I think I think my hot air heating element is due for a change. King underscore Jacob 732 became a member. Is that me or? I don't think it is. Oh, no, it's not. Um, Jacob, thank you. I appreciate it, mate. Brand spanking new retimer, courtesy of consolefix.shop. Damn it, I had it the right way around the first time. Eight months, damn. Thank you, guys. You know, I've still got two consoles that Ian gave me, which I never got to. Not jobs, I mean, he, he gifted them to me and I, I never got to them. Flow, my pretties, flow. Oi, I said flow. Hey, Travis is here. Oh, what's going on? Oi, microscope. Oi, microscope. Hang on a second, guys. Hang on. One moment. Let it reboot. Come on. There you go. Oh, look, it's magically done. <laughs> well, let me just test this resistance again. 5,000 ohms. That's a good reading. Here's a good reading. Thank you, Archie. Appreciate you, mate. Thank you for the super chat. It's 
to warm that solder back up and then I can clean them off. Baby, are you down, 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 down? Don't worry about that little bit of an indent in the uh, chip. It's perfectly normal when you press down on the chip. That looks in line to me. Right, let's have a look and see if this power's on. It should do. There you go. Just get rid of that old paste. Midlife Lab, welcome. Ellis, welcome. Matthias, welcome. <laughs> Yeet, mother flipper. Uh, if I miss anyone, I don't mean to. Um, hello, one and all. Right, let's pop some fresh thermal pasta on this bad boy. There you go. Thank you. Hate it when the uh, heatsink don't like to go on properly. There you go. Right, let's test it outside the housing. Nothing met. Oh, yeah, we've got some screws. Now let's test it outside the housing. Make sure it works. Spin. Fan spin. 
Yeah, boy. First win of the day. Well, assuming it turns on, that is. Ha. <laughs> All right. Yeet. Now work, damn it. Oh, display. Oh, Xbox One, oh, Xbox One, show me your signal, you bastard. Come on. Hang on. Let me clean out the HDMI cable. One moment. Yeah, yeah, I've switched over to the other capture card to, uh, well, try and get a display. Come on, give me a display. Pretty, please. Okay, it's not picking up anything. Hmm. Hang on. Let me just make sure that it's not... What is going on? Why are you not... Oh, the damn thing's just shut off. That could be a bad hard drive. Could be a bad hard drive. Give it a minute. Yeah, I think that's a bad hard drive. Um, he should wrap. <laughs> nah, don't want to take don't, don't want to take the limelight off stairs. Well, I think that's going to shut itself down again in a minute. Um, chances are, it's got a bad hard drive. The hard drive don't sound good anyway. To be honest. Still no signal. Rabbit hole. Nah. I I haven't got a favourite, mate. Well, that's actually not shutting itself down, interestingly. Um let me just try another hard drive real quick. Yeah, well, I used to do that myself as well, Dan, to be honest with you. Well, it's a Foxconn cable, so that shouldn't be bad. Jamie's been a member for eight months. Nice. Yeah, it's a Foxconn cable, so shouldn't be bad. The Foxconn ones very rarely fail. Could be a bad chip. Not going to rule out a faulty chip. Let's just try that. The fan is spinning, by the way. Cheers, Jay. How's it going, lovey? Sure, it's not a bad fish. <laughs> One pair on a stay on with a bad chip. Um, well, it would if it was a, just a not just a bad install. Could be a bad HDMI cable. I mean, a bad port, sorry. 
Hmm. They'll be strange. Let's just have a quick look at the cable, at the port itself. It shouldn't be my cable, it shouldn't be the capture card. Port seems okay. Damn it. What the hell? Why do why do my cables keep going? My signals keep going nuts tonight. Hmm. Have I got another hard drive just in case it's the hard drive? Because that was a random one I just picked up off my desk. Whether that works, I don't know. Hey, Ellis, thanks, dude. Appreciate you, mate. Right. Ellis Starbucks Super Chat is $11.32. Could be a PS4 hard drive. That one was. Is it going to display? Not by the look of it. Right, let me just make sure I've got Pebble going to the hard drive. Oh, that's just booted into safe mode. Hold up. Hmm. Hold up. Try it back on the splitter. No, it's not recognising a display at all. Uh, okay, well. Yeah, it's not recognising a display at all. So, we still have an issue. Could it be the SD chip? Hopefully not, because they're damn expensive. Could very well have taken out the ESD chip. I certainly can't rule that out as a possibility. Definitely can't rule that out as a possibility. Well, it was supposed to be an easy job. Replace the feckin' port. Uh, it looks actually, you know what? I think that port might have been replaced. Actually, no, no, never mind. I don't think it has. Um, Dooby doo, let's just have a look. Has it? Yeah, that's not a factory port. It is not a factory port, my friends. Eat shit, you bastard.
And the chips lined up. Hmm. Could maybe do with a bit more solder on it. I'll try I'll try a bit more solder. Um Yeah, I'll try I'll try adding some more solder to it. I don't think it's the port. Bridge on pins 15 and 16. Nah. I don't think it's the port. It doesn't the port looks okay. Um Is that a hole? That's just from where I pressed down with the tweezers, mate. Right, where did I put my solder out? There it is. What we're fixing today. Uh, this is a Xbox One X, mate. At the moment, Well, that's got enough solder, hasn't it? That'll work, right? Ah, it'll be fine. Wow. I was losing quite a bit of heat there. Was losing a bit of heat there. If it don't work now, I'll try changing the chip just in case it's damaged it. Uh, by installing it. You know, you never know. It could be a defective chip. I mean, it's very rare, but you do sometimes get a bad chip here and there. I mean, I'll buy them in pack to 250, so, and I think the last defective chip I had was about five, 600 chips ago. So, Yeah, don't know. Don't know if I'm due a bad chip or not. That's oh, turned off. It is turned off. Might help if I actually had the hard drive plugged in. Hmm, 
it's not lighting up. It's not lighting up. Yeah. Wheaty, thank you. W thirty three five super chatted two dollars and forty two cents. Bloody hope not lol. Now it's lighting up. Bloody hope not lol. <laughs> Hang on. Hang on. That lit up for a second. Come on. Is that a cable issue? Hmm, could very well be a port issue. I might change the port for good measure. Hey, there we go. Okay, we've got low resolution. Hey, okay, we get low resolution for a second. Um, right, okay, we do get low res. Okay, where's my Xbox controller at? Hey, display, you bloody bastard. Thank you. Yeah, I think we might need to change the port on this. Where's my Xbox controller gone? Hmm. Did it returns? <laughs> yeah, if it, if it, if it was faulty, yeah, I would do. Right. Okay. Man, why is that taking so long? Surely they didn't take. Do they really take this long to boot up? I don't know. I'm used to it. I'm used to current gen now. Surely they don't take that long. Uh, this is the original hard drive, mate. Test SSD. You can't for Xboxes, mate. Right, that is booting up. I'm just trying to connect up the fan because I don't want it overheating. Oh, okay. Well, that's uh, someone's tried the old three button press on this. Right. A skip sign in settings. Okay, it works in ten eighty. Is it working 4K? I don't think it's going to work in 4K. It'll probably come up there. It's not able to actually connect. Um, or it'll just go back to 1080 because I'm on a capture card. Yep, okay. Let's just make sure the fidelity... Yep, it's on auto detect, so that's all working. Um, yeah, seems to be fine. 
Um, do I change the port for good measure? No. No, I think I'll leave it, to be honest. We're not going to pick up Wi-Fi because I haven't got a card plugged in. Uh, the data's there, but the customer's going to need to re-log in. Yeah, seems to be fine. Yeah, I think it's just flux in the port. It'll get a good clean before it goes back to the customer. <clears throat> Sometimes with retail replacements, I found that 4K just won't work after replacing them, in my experience. Normally, that's down to the SDIC when that's the case. Uh, but the if 4K doesn't work on these, it's because it's connected to my capture card. If I put if I put this on the TV, if I actually had any battery pair in my TV remote, um, I'd test 4K. But unfortunately, I don't have any pair in my remote. So yeah, but yeah, seems to be working fine. It's picking up 4K and it's on auto. So yeah, seems fine to me. Uh, it'll get a full test before the customer gets it back. Give the port a wiggle. Uh, should be all right. Um, the port seems fine physically. I did look inside it before I actually turned it on. Those chips are stupid small. Yeah. You get used to them, though. Move the hell on. Yeah. Discuss the port with the customer. Um, that's a, It's an option, but nah, I think it's fine. Police choppers are out. Probably looking over my uh, loft with a the thermal cam saying, oh, I wonder what's going on in there. <laughs> no, there's actually a cop who watches me, so. <laughs> Got the thermal cam. He's growing weed again. Cheers, Gordon. Yep, let's just get this back together. And uh, that is turned off, by the way. I know the fan's running, but that's set to always on. It's fine. <coughs> you must have good eyesight to see his chopper from inside the, lo inside the loft. <laughs> nah, I could hear it hovering over. Well, it wasn't hovering, it was just passing over. Had a PS5 since I came out and you've had it vertical, would you suggest switching it to horizontal? Really been wondering. That is the question. <laughs> it may, honestly, it really doesn't make a difference. It's like one in a thousand that are failing, if that. Ask the customer if you'd like me to do a retimer instead of who's scared I broke it, didn't charge him. Um, yeah, I hate it when people when you get people like that. They're like, but YouTube said that would work. You can't help it sometimes, it's just the way some people are. No PS5 politics in chat. <laughs> Let's stir the shit pot. Why not? I mean, Travis is here. Shit always get shit always gets stirred when Travis is around. It's just the norm. <coughs> By the way, if you do want one of them shirts, limited time because unfortunately, and it is sad to say, but the company who manages the merch for me. He's closing down because they can't see a viable way forward, unfortunately, which really does suck. I'll probably just start producing my own, to be honest. Right, where the freaking hell's that last screw? Hey, Mr. Screw, where have you gone? I knew you're here somewhere.
Where's that gone to? Brandon, thank you, mate. Damn it. Where's that screw gone? Hmm. You son of a bitch. I'll find it in a minute. I will find it in a minute. Phil thinks I'm taking another shot. Hmm. Do we sing and make him get drunk? Should we sing and make him get drunk? I've lost a screw. Of course, that's nothing new. I've got a screw loose anyway. There it is on the floor. Got it. Sing, sing, sing. For the shots you sink won't mean a thing. Unless Phil sings. Sing, sing, sing. Yep, drink up, Travis. You better drink up. Uh, see, I'm losing my mind now because the screws wasn't in this. I found a screw. For me, darling, just dive right in. Follow my lead. Right, I will gather my bearings eventually. There we go. Is it worth me selling the launch model PS5 and replacing it with a new model? Um, no, just lighter and draws a little bit less power. I wouldn't, I wouldn't bother doing that, mate. Personally, if you ask me, I wouldn't, I wouldn't bother. Just keep the launch model. I might sell my PS5 1200 series though, because I'm never going to use the damn thing. It is brand new. I don't know. No, I'll probably keep it. I found love for me. 
Darling, just dive right in. Follow my lead. Where's my T ten gone? Starbucks Super Chat is $6.05. Shut up singing or I will be Your T10s with my 10 mil. Yeah, everyone loses the 10 mil, mate. <laughs> Sarah be up there whooping your ass. <laughs> Sarah's way past waking up now, mate. Can't drink that damn fast. Slow down. <laughs> nope. Anyway, I better behave because I'm losing viewers. Thinking scared them off, yeah. It's your singing. That's blasphemy. That's what that is. That's blasphemy. I have the voice of an angel. I can even say it with a straight face. I have the voice of an angel being strangled. <laughs> we need a karaoke night. Sounds good to me. A voice for TV and a face for radio. <laughs> angel of hell, mean. Emotional damage. Just threw up a little in your mouth. Well, stop kissing your mum then. <laughs> the voice of an angel with a chest infection. Yeah. Volume down button doesn't work. Change of flex. Can't work out what the issue is. Uh, it could be the connector. It could be a resistor. Um, could be a resistor on that line, maybe. You just have to trace it out, I guess. You really had to fart when you said that through the straight face. Yeah. No, on a serious note, get the hearts out in chat for Travis's mom. Can't help but recognise the accent. I'm from Warsaw and watch a lot, but never heard where you're based. Uh, very close, mate. Um, I'm in Willingall, so not far. My sister lives in Pelsall. How's it going, Chris? How you doing? Yeah, so not far from you there, mate. Uh, I used to live in Pelsall, well, close to Pelsall myself. Um, I used to live on uh, Livingston Road. <laughs> yeah, 
Yeah, I'm good, thanks, Chris. Damn it, I hate it when this happens. Hate it when this happens. Oi. Sit back on your spot. Thank you. There you go. Right. Get in there. Right, not much longer than now. From Dudley. I was born in Dudley. I was born in Burley Hill. Well, I was born in Wordsley Hospital. I grew up in Burley Hill. Said she's not had it going on since she, since her thirties. Yeah, but I still find her attractive, mate. <laughs> There's new hairs coming along. Uh, get in there, mate. Slowly but surely. We are almost done. Yeah, slowly but surely, bud. It'll get there. There's a few things which are going to have to wait for a little while, but... Yeah. <coughs> Keep at it, yeah. Yeah, it'll get there eventually. I'm going to do an up update video. I keep saying I'm going to do one, but... Yeah, I'm going to wait until I'm close to actually moving in, and then I'll do an update video. I reckon... Well, I, ideally, I want to be done in the next four weeks. That's with everything. Like, I want to be ready to move in in four weeks. Um, because I've agreed with the landlord to start paying rent from the 1st of March. So, yeah, I want everything done in four weeks so we can move in. And some people are going to call me an arsehole, but the landlord at this place ain't getting another penny out of me. But I'm not paying him any more rent. He's refused to do repairs for seven years. So he can fuck himself. To be honest with you. <laughs> he can screw himself. Ooh, that's not good. He needs a new... Um, I'm going to have to contact the customer about that. He needs a new sync button. That wasn't connected when I actually got it, so that wasn't me. We need a new sync button. Um, fairly straightforward to sort out. I can replace it for the customer, but not without their consent. That's not what it got sent in for. Ah, so now fuck you so ways. Yeah, yeah. What's he going to do? Kick me out? Like some people might say it's slow, but no, fuck him. Hopefully the landlord doesn't watch the streams. He's already kicking me out, mate. There's nothing else he can do. Do you know why he's kicking us out? Because we asked him to do repairs. And I'm not even joking. I'm not even joking. Four or five weeks ago, I turned around to the landlord and said, if I... Um, if, if I do the plastering or if I pay for someone to come in and do it, can you pay for the materials? He said, no, because Section 21's in the post. Damn it, damn it, damn it. I hate you, my cable's stuck. No, that's no bullshit, that is genuinely what he said. He said, no, because your Section 21's in the post. Well, no, sorry, he said your Section 21's with the solicitor. So, yeah, fuck the landlord. I mean, this landlord, I mean, not the new landlord. Just send you a message on Discord, done a sign to see if you like them. Awesome, dude. 
I'll take a look at it later on, mate, if that's all right. Right, I'm gonna, I'm gonna screw this in. Um, it is damaged. But I am gonna screw it in at least, just to keep it secure. Stop that from flapping around in the breeze. Let the council and the inspectors in. Yeah, I am. The house has already been reported, mate. Smash the kitchen. Nah, I'm not going to do any damage. Um, I'm just not paying him any more rent. I haven't paid him any rent now since the 1st of January. Uh, I paid him his rent on the 1st of January. That was it. I, I paid him up until the end of last month. He ain't getting nothing this month. And he ain't getting nothing in March either. Uh, I'm not going to do any damage to the house because then I could actually get done. I could actually get nicked for that or prosecuted or took to court or whatever. Um, anything that I've paid for is coming with me, whether I need it or not. For example, the cooker. Um, it was a fitted cooker, well, cooker hob. So it's fitted into the worktops. That packed up about a year ago. He refused to pay for it, even though it was in when we moved in. So I paid for it out of my own pocket. And um, yeah, that's coming with me. Um, the shower I installed out of pocket, that's coming with me. Anything that I've put in, I'm taking out. But anything that I've paid for out of my own pocket, it's coming with me. Whether I need it or not, I'm not leaving it for him. Sorry, but no. Right, why won't this case go back on? Right, why should I why should I leave it? Why should I give him the satisfaction of having free stuff off me? sells on eBay. No, it will scra I'll scrap it, mate. I'll scrap the lot. Like, I don't need it. Apart from the shed, the only thing I'm taking with me that I need is the shed, because that's going to be used as a storage shed. Because there's nothing wrong with it, it's just too small for my needs. Right, that still turns on. Yep, taking the shed. It's illegal to take things out of the apartment even though you legally pay for it. Oh no, not here. Um, if, if I've paid for it, and it's not, um, like because I've got evidence that he refused to pay for the cooker, so I'm okay on that point. Um, the shower wasn't installed when we moved in. I installed that myself, out of pocket, so I'll be taking that. The shed, that's mine anyway. Lay some keepers in the loft. <laughs> I could give it away. I, I, could, I could give it away. He can't fuck with my credit score. And there's no deposit on this house, so he can't even take that. He can't fuck with my credit score. Not for taking stuff that belongs to me. And he can't anyway. Uh, I can't get a mortgage, mate. I've got CCJs for the next two years. No, sorry, a year. I've got a CCJ what comes off next month and I, then I've got another one what comes off next year. And then I can get a mortgage. Yeah, he is selling the property. Um, that's, his, that's his reason for the Section 21. Right, that is all turning on and working. But yeah, I think he's already sold the house, to be honest. Uh, county court judgment for unpaid debts from years ago. Bet the landlord is loaded. No, <laughs> he's broke as fuck. The, the dumb fuck signed over a pair of attorneys to, pay, to someone else. And that's why the houses are being sold. Because he's stupid. He ain't got no money.
because he can't be dealing with the new laws on rentals coming in. Uh, well, it all started when he got made to spend 20 grand on his other property. If he sues, you can move it to high court uh, without you getting a day in court. Can he move it? No. $10. I know this isn't typically your thing, but do you recommend lubricating a dual sense joystick after cleaning with EPA? I've got a couple squeaking joysticks at the moment. Um, I don't know. I don't think that's a good idea, as far as I know. Uh, I could be wrong, but I don't think that's a good idea. I appreciate that, by the way, Jake. Uh, but I don't think that's a good idea. I think, um, if, uh, if they're squeaking and stuff, um, I think you have to, you have to replace them. I think, oh, that's the best option. Oh yeah, that's another thing that's coming with me. My carbon monoxide alarm. <laughs> Not the smoke alarms, but my carbon monoxide alarm separate. That's coming with me. Still got eight, still got eight years left on it. On the uh, recommended replacement guide thing. Why don't you read my insults? Because I don't like you. <laughs> right, I'm going to go get the next job. Anyway, I'll be back in a minute, guys and girls. DW100. Yeah, I've seen Tronic Fix mention that a few times. Maybe give that a try. Possibly. Right, I'll be back.
Yo. Yeet. Put that coffee there because uh, it tilts people. Ha. Smoking a fag. <clears throat> oh, don't talk to me about... Uh, don't talk to me about slang. You get snowflakes. <laughs> Most people seem to vape. Uh, yeah, I'm going to quit, but I'm not going to vape to quit. Right. Um, okay, so we're going to PS5. This has come all the way from Israel. So they've sent motherboard only with the heating for protection. And I'm not sure is this. Yeah, that, okay, this is a 1200 series power supply. That's the wrong power supply. Um, right, okay. 1100 series then. Right. So this has come all the way from Israel. It comes with board only. And I think it's got a blue light of death. I think. I think it's a blue light of death. So, if I can find a front panel to use. If I can find a front panel to use. Un moment, senor. And I'm walking away to find a better day. Right, so this is a digital edition PS5. And apparently he's got blue light of death, so I've popped my own power supply in it, a known good power supply from consolefix.shop. Let's have a look and see what's going on. Can you invoice me and send my switch back, please? Which one was that, mate? Right, that seems to be turning on. Can you send me my missus back? <laughs> hmm. Batman. Shit, I was supposed to invoice you on... What was it, Monday? Or Friday? Yeah. Um... Yes, I will invoice you in a minute. Give me a minute and I'll send you an invoice over, mate. Uh, right, that's a lung pulsing blood. That's not good. That's not good. I completely forgot to invoice you on that, mate. Um, bear with me a second, because I need to plug my... Um, I need to plug my keyboard back in and I'll do that right away and then I'll get it sent back first thing for you. I'll say first thing, it'll be like four o'clock when I go to the post office, but uh, let me just. You watch PayPal ask me to uh, verify my phone number and I ain't got my phone with me. One moment. No, oh, for fuck. Typical. I ain't got my freaking phone with me either. Um, I'll do it right after the stream, mate. As soon as I finish the stream, I'll, I'll send that because it won't let me log into PayPal to send an invoice. Discount then. Uh, I'm sure we can work something out. 
yeah, he, he won't let me send. He won't let me log into PayPal. So I'll, I'll no, I'll if I do it tomorrow, I'll forget because I've got that much on. Right, that is a lung pulsing blood. That is a lung pulsing blood. Yeah, if I do it tomorrow, I'll probably forget, mate. So someone do me a favour just before I end the stream and remind me if you can, because I will forget. Cheers, mate. Uh, I'm, I'm only going to be working on this one anyway. Um, or if you want to... Uh, RCG, if you want to drop me a message on the store after I finish, if that's easier. I can invoice you through my online store, actually. But again, not on the computer. <laughs> uh, because I haven't got my phone for two-factor. And my online store's admin panel is... 100% two factor every time I log in. So, random, but have you watched The Last of Us? I haven't, mate, no. I haven't, to be honest, I haven't had a chance to watch anything recently. Uh, but I don't watch much, you know, much TV and stuff anyway. I'd rather watch stuff by individual creators because the stuff on TV is just, it's, it's all the same these days. Pretty sure this is Val job said something about liquid damage as well. When I looked at it. Fancy a laugh, go on. Yeah, I mainly watch YouTube. I do watch a little bit on, on um Disney Plus and Netflix, but honestly, just not very often. To be honest with you, most of the time, like, I'll do my, my daily routine of doing like my, my store orders and the admin stuff like that, and, and then I'll pick the kids up from school and then I'll, uh, I'll have something to eat and fall asleep. <laughs> Don't watch TV either, streaming series, yes, podcast, etc. But the days are just mindlessly watching telly is long dead. Yeah, yeah. To be honest, I've never really been into watching TV. I've never seen the benefit of it. Like, to me, it's just wasted time. Like, if I'm having a shit on the to toilet, maybe. But other than that, it's just wasted time. I'd rather be doing something. Um, we do occasionally do raffles, and in fact, actually, there is one running on Discord. Find it, fix it, Philip. It's got one running for uh, Xbox Series X that he needs to sit, that he needs to fill up. Rich, you serious? Who's rich? What are we looking at? Got married four years today, my wife. That's for a split up. Oh wow, mate, that I'm sorry to hear that. Do you want to unplug the console? No, because I want to get voltage readings. <laughs> mate, I'm sorry to hear that, honestly. That really does suck. Right, okay, we're going EDMO two O board. Let's see if there's anything showing up with the thermal cam. Shushly, I need a I need to laugh. <laughs> Johnny Fix. Johnny Fix isn't here, is he? If he is, hi. Hello. Nah, Johnny Fix isn't here. Might be watching, but he's not in the chat. F 
<laughs> this is a little brother I wish my mum would have spit out. <laughs> nah, we know, Lee. But no, I want to get voltage readings, mate. That's why I left it turned on. Right. Uh, okay, so RAM is powering on. Um, SSD controller gets warm. Uh, yeah, thermal cam seems okay. Oh, that's hot. <coughs> right. Hey, hey, hey. Damn it. I pressed the buttons on my Steam Deck. Stream Deck, not Steam Deck. Right, voltage readings. Oh, damn it, wrong one. Voltage readings. Shouldn't you have that vertical? That's the question. Pre ordered the S23 Ultra. Ugh. Samsung are getting worse with the S series and the Note series. Honestly, they really are. Sarah bought the S. Well, I got Sarah the S twenty two for her birthday. Uh, we had to return it because every time you every time you went outside in the cold, the speaker would pop and it wouldn't work for about an hour after you'd gone back indoors. And my sister's Note twenty two crashes randomly every hour or so. This board took an impact. That's not good. This board's took an impact. We've got a bit of damage here, a little bit of damage there. In fact, yeah, that's took a drop of some sort. So we've got 5 volts there, 3.3, 5, 1.8, 5, 2. 0 0.8, 2.5, 0.9, 0.9, 12, 12, 5, 1.36, 5.35 5 3.3 3. I'm just checking the voltage rail see what we've got 12 yeah I mean this all seems okay to me uh, I haven't Colin no to be honest I haven't really been on discord recently uh, what's up, mate? Can you type it here at all? Right, voltage rails. As far as voltage rails are concerned, these all seem absolutely fine. 1.1. Yeah. Just turn that off a minute. Let's see if I can get into safe mode. Your significant other wants an exploitable one. Uh, I think I've got one. I'm sure I have. Um, I'll have to let you know, mate. Uh, I'm pretty sure I've got one. Right, I'm just trying to get into safe mode. That's looking like it's not going to boot into safe mode, though.
Oh dear. Problem is we don't know what it, whether we can get to UART on these, so... Hmm. Yeah, this could be a difficult one. I'm not going to spend too much time on this, though, to be honest. I know it's come from Israel, but... Honestly... Better off selling the customer replacement board. Because this is going to be a rabbit hole, to be honest with you. It's going to be a rabbit hole. Thought it worked better upside down. <laughs> oh, yeah, this has took an impact. Taken an impact. Oh, it's had quite a bit of rework as well. Ellis Starbucks Super Chat is $3.63. I thought the PS5 worked better upside down. <laughs> Cheers, Ellis. Um, mainly PlayStation, mate, to be honest. Right. Yeah, this is going to be a rabbit hole to hell. It's had a lot of rework. Why? I don't know. Someone has just randomly changed components. I'm not spending too long on this at all. Yeah. Random components been replaced. Uh, it's took an impact. Um, we've got signs of an impact in the corner here. You see that? Chip, chips in the substrate there. There's a chip in the substrate there. Um, the liquid metal don't seem great. So uh, that's been it's been lifted off. Right, let's have a look underneath. That's just a donor board, yeah, I'm thinking the same. I think this is going to be fine. Let me just uh, tilt this on an angle. Oh.
I'm looking more for damage caps than anything. God damn it. No, that, that seems okay. Doesn't seem to be an issue. This is definitely liquid damaged, or he's definitely had liquid damage. Uh, so we've got very obvious signs that it's coming into contact with liquid, just based on this around here, around the edge. But... Um... Yeah, I don't really know how long I want to be spending on this because it's had quite a lot of rework. Um, I mean, yeah, it, look at all these. Look, this can actually cause a big issue. Um, we've got some filters there which... Uh, very obviously in bad shape. What about the filters for the SSD? In fact, there is filters for the SSD. Okay, so that could be causing an issue. Um, Yeah, if even one of those are not making a contact, it could be causing data uh, data issues, like signal issues. Um, and they don't look good. In fact, they look really, really bad. Do I reflow those filters? I know that sounds stupid, but if there's a contact issue on one of them, those filters are there for a reason, and all of that is data lines for the uh, for the SSD. If you follow this back up on these traces, so you've got all of these traces coming down here. If you follow them all up, they go through some wires here on these four groups here. So these are what's known as differential pairs. <coughs> so you've got a positive and a negative uh, signal line. And they go into the SSD controller. And the reason some of these are going through VOIRS is because they're going through to the SSD chips on the other side. And then you've got the ones for this side as well. Ooh. And even that don't look great. But if we've got a contact issue on any of these filters, that can potentially cause issues. And that looks like it's coming to direct contact with liquid. It don't look, don't look good. So let me just carry on hunting around for a minute, but that is an area of interest. It's definitely an area of interest, same as the SSD controller itself. Why this has been, why this has had random components reflowed, I don't know. Or replaced, I don't know. But if this can't recognise the SSD, then it would cause a blue light of death. It would normally either cause a blue light of death or no power. Little bit of randomness there. Yeah, so it's looking like the only area so far that could have come into contact with liquid is probably going to be the SSD. Hmm.
random spots of liquid metal in some places. But that could have flicked off when I took the foam off. Don't think that's going to be the cause. It's definitely had an impact. And I don't think they, don't think it would have had an impact in shipping, even though it has come from Israel. If it had an impact in shipping, it probably would have caused more damage than that. Yeah, it's just little random spots of liquid metal here, there, and everywhere. So it's definitely had a splatter. James Matheson became a member. I think we've got some channel renewals coming through. So give that a minute. Thank you to everyone. I really appreciate it. Um, this area has been reworked, but I'm not really concerned about that. Uh, that wouldn't cause a blue light of death normally unless there's a short on pin 15. Yeah, flux all over that. Wow. What the hell? Why has all of this been replaced? Like why? I don't understand why all of these caps would have been replaced. If it's powering on, there's nothing wrong with those caps. Jesus Christ. Good Lord. Oh God, wow. Jesus Christ. Good golly gosh. Well, I mean... It, it could be a case where it's um, not been pairing, where it wasn't pairing on, and they've managed to get it to pair onto a blue light. That is possible. Um, there's a lot of rework gone on, and that's the problem. Is I don't know what soldering is good and what's not good. Don't think it's going to be anything to do with RAM. That's just crud. So even this side, there's little spots of liquid metal. No, that's not. That's just crud. That's just crap. Hmm. Six months in a row need, need sleep. <laughs> Been a member for six months. Thanks, Brian. Yeah, this could literally be an SSD communication issue because of those data lines. It is possible. Um... Definitely been some liquid heat around here. Nothing that seems to be causing an issue. Yeah, the only thing I'm finding here is literally that um, that area around the SSD. Uh, 
Um, yeah, not sure really. Um, I think, I think realistically, this is all I'm finding is what looks to be some pretty rough filters on the um on the ssd circuit on the ssd data lines but that don't they don't look good at all really so i think flux and reflow on those filters the filters are not going to be bad but if one or more of them are not making contact because of corrosion then it can cause an issue and they've definitely come into contact with the liquid I'm going to knock my airflow down to 10% and I'm using um, chip quick flux for this because it is good at busting corrosion it's a lot better than King Bow at getting rid of corrosion I'm just going to preheat. This board definitely needs an ultrasonic clean. If you bear with me a sec, mate, I'll get you a link to that um, cloning machine for the M2 drives. Diesel.
Let's give this a good scrub. Scrub it up, dub. Well, I mean, that looks a million times better than what it did. Um, yeah, definitely better than what it was. So, if there was any corrosion under any of those filters causing any kind of um, contact issue, then that's going to have sorted that out. But it does look a million times better. I mean, you can actually see where the some of the traces have been damaged as well. Look, um, look see the gold points here where the copper's exposed on the pad. Uh, that don't look great, does it? Um, but I think that's going to have solved any contact issues anyway. Let's just have a look, see if that does anything to change the behaviour, shall we? Um, but I don't think I want to spend much longer on this, just given how much rework has been done. To be honest, if I'd have known this much rework had been done, I would have rejected the job. Um, I could try ultrasonic cleaning it, but not tonight, because that would wake up the entire house. So, if I ultrasonic clean it, that would be tomorrow. Where did I put my front panel? There it is. I'm not worried about putting that foam on for now. Right, let's have a look. So it still turns on to a blue light. I'm in my loft at the minute, yeah. Does it boot? Yeah, coffee's freezing now. No, that's not going to boot. Yeah, I don't think I want to spend any more time on this, to be honest. Just given... Just given the amount of rework that's been done. Um... I think sometimes you just have to give up on these um, or refuse to work on them. Voltage rails are all present. It's getting warm in the right places. That's because you're a quitter. <laughs> my fault more often so you get paid even if, if you can't fix a console no I don't charge if I can't fix it I don't charge if I can't fix it unfortunately <laughs> F 
I'm done late, my lazy. <laughs> Is this the Israel Challenge? This one has come from Israel. Not the same board that I worked on from Israel, but it has come from Israel. <coughs> yeah, I don't think it's going to be worth continuing with it. To be honest, push down on the CPU. Nah, there's not a thing on the PS5s. Try the BIOS off for 10 minutes. Uh, I think it's been desoldered. Yeah, I will definitely invoice you, mate. Yeah. Yeah, it's not going to boot up. Well, yeah, I don't think I want to spend any more time on this. Just, just given the fact that um, it's had so much rework done to it. Um, sending Sarah up there. <laughs> now, I'll, I'll have to do it from my phone because I can't log into PayPal. It won't let me. Yeah. Oh, awesome, awesome, uh, Roman. Don't feel bad. Yeah, it's one of them. I just uh, there's just too much rework being done to it. I can offer the customer a board swap. Um, you know, it's a discounted rate. But even that's probably not going to be economically viable. Try safe mode. I've tried it, mate. I've tried it. I'll try it again, but sometimes I watch it, yeah. Yeah, that's not going to boot into safe mode. It's going to shut down. Took too long for that second beep. Yeah. Well. Yeah. It is what it is. Not going to waste any more time on it. Um, do, 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 do. What can I do? What can I do? What can I do? I think... I think that's going to be it for tonight. Um, because I've got an early start again tomorrow. Yeah, people send them from all over the world, yeah. What's fucked from the start? Yeah, I just don't think it's worth wasting much time on it. Um, I'll try ultrasonic cleaning the board tomorrow. But, yeah, never mind. Right. Um... Yeah, I'm going to forward the computer boot up because I've got an early start again in the morning. So I was only planning on streaming for a few hours. So yeah, computer boot will stream after, uh, or be on. A uh, computer booter should be live. 3.3, 1 .8 volt on 5 pin DC to DC spikes of power on. 3.31.8 on 5 pin DC slash DC spikes of power no, I'm not sure, to be honest, mate. Uh, what console are we talking about? Don't forget, in, don't forget in Discord. Yep, no worries, mate. Please check Discord. I'll have a look. Uh, yeah, I'm not sure on that when it comes to when you've got spikes. Um, most likely just a bad chip. Yep, I'll do the invoice. Yep, definitely, I'll do the invoice. Yeah, most likely you get a bad chip, but it's hard to say. It could be a bad resistor somewhere. It's one of those that would be difficult without seeing it.
Now shorts, swap the safe for the same CPU heat spike, RAM spikes. Um, hmm, difficult. Thank you, Munchies. Bruh. I'll forward the invoice to Travis. <laughs> Super Travis Cheers, Paul. Bruh. After this one, I don't feel so bad sending some old ones your way. <laughs> yep. Yep. Oh, uh, dear. Uh, in my experience, marry the board. Marry the board because after the wedding, wedding it will never go down again. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> right. Uh, and I have a second console, give same error on PS5 games, PS4 works good. It could be the SSD controller on that one, possibly. Yeah, maybe post in Discord, maybe someone can help you there. Um, and I'll try and get on when I can to help as well. Heat controller starts working again. Mm, yeah, rabbit hole to hell. Right, I will catch everyone later. I'm going to get off. Uh, like I said, early start tomorrow. Uh, I'll try ultrasonic, ultrasonic cleaning this board, but doubtfully it'll work. But yeah, thank you all for hanging out. I really do appreciate it. Yeah, it's from Steve, yeah. Todd's just played cast powered one. <laughs> but yeah, um, check out Computer Booter. He's going to be streaming something. Highly recommend it. Go and call him a prick from me. And, uh, yeah, thank you all. I appreciate it. I'll be back as soon as I can. Um, but there's a lot of stuff on at the minute, so I'm not sure on my streaming schedule. But, yeah, I do appreciate it. appreciate the support. Thank you all. I'll see you all on the next one. Good night, everyone.